So I took a studio art class in college and it was a still life that I was trying to create and I tried so hard to make this metal cup look exactly like the metal cup and I worked so hard and finally I thought that I had it and I showed it to her so proud and excited and she came over she said what did you do to you know what you had before was so much better and I said but no but now it looks exactly like the cup she said yeah well now it could just be a photograph you don't have any of your own interpretation in it and and you know it's just it's just there. And so that really shifted my entire perspective on art from trying to like, represent something completely accurately to really trying to infuse some of my own perspective and unique thoughts as an artist and interpretation into the work that I do. So now I don't do anything representational. Everything I do is totally abstract. Pianos are very exciting because they're really just wood and, I mean, whatever else, ivories, whatever are strings, whatever is in there, but the only way they come to life is when somebody, you know, adds their own energy into it. It needs to be played in order to really reach its full potential and, you know, artwork, I think, can have that same effect. Artwork is only interesting based on the viewer who sees it. You know, if artwork is in a closet, you create it, it doesn't have as much energy or life. It's when somebody sees it and puts their own energy into what they're seeing, that's when it comes alive. I mean, the main thing I want is for people to stop. I want them to be like, what, a piano? You know, and they'll notice it more when it's brightly colored and it's decorated um, in different ways so that all of these pianos are so different and so innovative and interesting and intriguing is really exciting. I want people to see my piano and say, I've never seen anything like that before. And why is a piano you know, in the middle of the city? Um, and hopefully just for a brief moment for people to shift that perspective and maybe engage in some creative activity, whether it's playing the piano, listening to somebody else play the piano, or just thinking about art in a different way. The work that I do, I hope, is something different and unique that they haven't seen before. So the idea that I'm creating something and putting something out there that is something new and could cause people to just stop or think for, for a minute a little bit differently is really exciting to me.